right, so we took off our shoes here at the bench, and um, um, we're not sure if it's free or not, but he said it was free, so we just gave the shoes in, and we didn't pay anything at one of the windows. And Dylan actually took off his socks. My goodness. In the open. And now we go to the Golden Temple and see if I can take my bag and my camera in. You still don't have anything to cover your hand. So I got, I have this to cover my head. Now Dylan needs something. Take one if you want. It'll be quicker. Okay. He's found something. All right. And then there's some guards with spears over there. That's what I saw last night. And it looked pretty nice out here at night. <laughs> there goes Dylan over there. What are you looking at, Dylan? I worry about it. Oh, something. Oh my god, what is that thing? I feel like this place is always filled with people, like tons of people everywhere. Oh, look, carp. Can you like feed them? Okay. Oh, so you can bathe in there? Yeah. Huh. Interesting. I want to swim with the fish. Catch one. No, I don't. That's how I just feel, feel so wrong. Though. So Dylan's super hungry and he's like waiting in line to get some tortillas or something. I don't know. I just, I'm just following him. I'm gonna throw it into the fish. No, you can't throw edibles in the in the, the holy pool. Well, you're gonna have to deal with it because the fish are hungry. They get fed. They look fine. Have you seen them get fed? No. And you can't say they've been fed. True. Okay. Um. Do we give money? Okay. It looks like you give money over there. We donate. Donate. How much you want to donate? Hundred. Two fifty. Okay, so we got we got leaves and there's stuff on the bottom. And uh, we both gave a hundred rupees each. And we're not we're not sure if we're supposed to eat it or not. Just seeing if anybody's doing anything with it.
You throw the ticket over there. Ah, uh, there. <laughs> she just went. I'm not sure. So we we got this to. So we got this to give? I don't know. So we got a bowl. So we cut. Now we got an even smaller bowl. <laughs> Not sure why. I have no idea. And then we give. Give us a bag. Thank you. In the bag? Hanji in the bag. Thank you. I'm very confused. I'm very confused. Now there's a huge line. And I don't know what's at the end of it. Golden Temple maybe? Huh? You think there's a golden temple at the end of this line? Probably a golden ticket. Golden ticket? The line to the Willy Wonka is this factory. is this the candy? Is this yep. the um, the everlasting gum stoppers? Yeah. <laughs> Stars where it tastes like stuff. <laughs> okay. So we got our shoes back. Uh, it didn't actually cost anything that like I thought it would. Um, we never found out what this is for. Not yet, anyways. And we didn't stay in line to find out what you kind of did it at the end of that line and inside the golden temple because Dylan doesn't like. Crowded, small line, long lines. I mean, yeah. And I don't think it's gonna be worth it. And you know. It also, you got something here, bro. On your nose. I think it's just you. Just I think you just like burnt. That's all. Probably. That's it. Let me show the viewers. Yep. There you go. Anyways, just dead skin. Yeah. Now we're putting on our shoes. Look at my feet. So dainty and beautiful. Not really. Anyways, that's a golden temple for you guys. It's mostly white, and, and there's a temple in the middle that's kind of gold. So what actually happened here? So, during the uh, Gandhi days, a bunch of people were out here flooding a uh, peaceful to protest when a British uh, army squad came in and opened fire with their guns. Killed like a thousand of them. Cold blood. Damn, dude. A lot of them jumped into a well, which is somewhere, and they drowned to death trying to get away. There should still be the bullet holes visible somewhere. I think over there. Maybe they fixed it. Seem to be fixing a lot of things. They don't fix these wounds, bro. Wounds can be healed with time and hard work. I don't think they're supposed to be over there. Seeing as there's chains everywhere. <laughs> They're natives. A giant egg thing. Just don't open it because there's an alien inside. 
The likeliest of scenarios. Dead space. Okay. They even mark it for you. Bullet holes and stuff. I'm not even doing that with the camera. It looks like you're tracking them with the, um, kind of like some kind of weird thing. It's okay. Oh, look at you with water. It's pretty good water. <laughs> We're all fighting to see the well, the ancient well of dwelling. I'm not sure, but there's a hole there. It's just a hole. Manual. It's just a hole. I don't know. I don't get it. It's just a hole. I don't get it. It's uh, when they were firing, a bunch of Indians jumped in there trying to save themselves. Oh shit! And then they drowned. Well, why did, didn't they know how to swim? Where they jumped? Well, I think they did. Just nobody bothered to pull them out. Oh well, shit. They also brought a uh, cannon, like a tank, with a huge cannon, but they weren't able to get it through the doors, so they didn't use it. Hmm. Artie's Gallery. The busy streets of Amritsar. All the wheels you could want. Tires, rims, all the wheels. Dylan. Sometimes if I don't look back, he's not there. And then I wonder what happened to him. He shows up eventually. We got watermelons. Well, I think it's watermelons. We got other type of watermelons. And then something that I think is called lichil. Looks like strawberries. Tuck tucks, always one looking at us. Asking if we want to ride. Occasionally, this place looks Americans look like chumps. We have Mr. Fix It. They got Dr. Fix It. Where? Right there. Oxifix. Welcome to the Grand Museum that Dylan wanted to go to. <laughs> Wait, How do you feel nice. about this, Dylan? I might be it. No, you're right. It's that one over there. Is that one? I'm pretty sure I'm right. Yeah, that one's the center. Oh, still? Alright, let's go into the... Huh? Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. He says it's not a museum. Like, 10% sure. Okay. But it's a nice, a nice park we're at. 
Look, look at these flowers. They're so just so beautiful. Look at them. So majestic. Wow. Glistening in the sun. And free brooms. They're just laying around. You could be a witch. A little witch. Okay. Here's the amazing palace. Amazing. I feel like the information I got was about five years out of date. And they just closed the place down. Opened it to squatters. Once again, amazing place. You got fallen trees and these cobble, whatever, brick There's garbage roads. on the ground. Garbage on the ground. Garbage. I mean, that's... That's India, but yeah, that's just—that's what the locals call soil. And then, yeah, looks like an interesting place. Maybe they're trying to fix it up over there. I, I don't know. Yep. Um. For not having another place to go? Yeah. Okay. So a bit. I accept that. Why would you do this? I accept, but I don't accept your choice of this place to go to. Well, in the end, it's really your fault. No matter how we place it. Tons of bricks, and yeah, it looks like they're fixing it up. Got this watering hole here. Take a dip, sir. All right. Looks nice and brown. Ish. Brownish. Brown, beyond brown. Oh. Right. Mm-hmm. This is the place. It's great. Yeah. Love it. It's cool. Joseph Gordon, love it. You want to go inside, sir? Nah. Okay. I don't want to disturb their working inner peaceness. And I bet it's not as great as it is outside. Inside, outside. Okay, we got here and now we're gone. Hope you enjoy, you guys enjoyed it. And I know um, I'll never be back, but. I might, I mean, it's under construction. Maybe when we come back, it'll be like the best place in India. Um, who says I'm coming back to India, bro? I do. I guess, uh, I guess I'm coming back to India. All right, we'll see you next time. Dylan can't seem to cross the road. He's over there. He's having a little bit of a hard time. There he is. There he is. <laughs> hey, we're going that way. How did you cross here? Because there's a lot of traffic, sir. Yeah, we're going with the traffic. I don't want to go with the traffic. I want to be out of traffic. Carlos, I bought some. Um, oh, sorry, I dropped my money. Okay, so I bought a kiwi. Um, pretty good, but it could be better when it feels cold. Tastes the same. A little bit more natural, though. Yeah, it's alright. I made sure to wash them, too, with uh, mineral water from a bottle. So these are. Um, I think they're called Lithil, Lithil or something like that. And uh, I bought about 12 of them for I think like 40 rupees, or rupees or something like that. I'm not sure if that's the price, but I still bought them. I still paid for them. And there you go. And what you do is you just peel the skin right off. And it's kind of like a like a grape almost now. Like with really, really thin skin. But there you go. It's all white. And then you eat it. Mm -hmm. And it has a pretty big pit in the middle. And I think it's super tasty. So, 
they look like strawberries and I've been wanting to give them a try for a while and they are not failing me they're pretty good I can't really describe it as any kind of other fruits I've tried before so it's a new experience for me and I'd say give it a try